Hey guys, welcome to another video on Yeeps VR. The first idea is a stasis chamber. Now I'm sure you guys have heard of this before, but basically what you need is a TNT block, a warp block, or a smoke bomb, and a, most importantly, a remote. Now what you do with these items is that you'll find a perfect place for it. So if I wanted to put a stasis chamber over here, it has to be at least three blocks high. Like that. Now another kind of thing that you can build in basement is a mockingbird shelter. Mockingbird shelter. Basically how a mockingbird shelter works is that say if you're running, you need somewhere to quickly hide, but there isn't really anywhere to hide. So, you just cr crawl into a slit and they lose you. Now, I can't guarantee every time that they won't see you, but it is very unnoticeable, as long as you have the right paint, which I personally think is black paint. How you build a mockingbird shelter is simple. The necessary resources you need is a 4x4 four four reinforced block, a stair, and a pillar. Now if you want, you can get smoke bombs and a remote, and say if someone were to crawl into your shelter, you could take out the cylinder and run out while the smoke distracts them. But that's unnecessary, and really expensive. So first you want to make the stairs, which is the entryway, the one block away from the doorway. Keep in mind it does have to be next to the doorway or it will be as noticeable. Once you get that done, you're gonna put the stair a stair here, the opposite direction. Now you're gonna put your 4x4 reinforced blocks here and here. This will serve as kind of a balcony way where you can hide and you won't be cramped in the entrance just in case someone sees your eyes. Okay, so this is where you're gonna want your cylinder block. This will serve as kind of an entryway to whatever you want to build out here. You're going to put the cylinder block right there, okay? This is now your Mockingbird base. The last step is to use black paint. Sorry, I had to swap servers because a bunch of fat people just broke the base, but this is what it should look like. Now look, if you're getting chased, right, and you're like, oh no, I'm getting chased by a bunch of people, where should I go? Then, you look up I there, see okay? What you do next, is you quickly come up what? here, into the slit, tilt your head, it's a and you should be fine. Now, the next strategy is vent plugging. What you want to do with vent plugging is you want to use a 2x2 two two bouncy thing, whatever those are called, and you want to face the spikes towards you, so it looks more abstract, more, more in place. Then you want to use black paint, paint if you need it or want it. You can use any paint, really. Just make sure it matches the environment. Then what you want to do is you want to put two warps like this. Okay? Make sure to do this on both ends, though. When someone comes, okay, you're going to activate it with the remote. It blasts them away. And you have time to run. Anyways, those are the three strategies I've picked up playing in basement. I hope this improved your play.